I feel like I'm losing my mind. To raise everybody in the world. Yeah. Welcome back to my channel, y'all. I have some videos by The Darkest Secret. These videos are intense and, you know, almost life changing videos right here. Um, Let's just react to them and learn something from them. You know, that's why I'm Come doing this video greatest. also. Everybody so you can be aware, like more aware of things, you know. Everything some things you can't be aware of, you know. Just, that's how life so is, you know. But, um, let's just get to it. Have you ever felt the breath of death on your neck? Knowing that you were seconds away from not existing. Well, the people in this video do. Although this video is not paranormal in itself, each scene you will see will border on the supernatural, as if angels or unknown forces had intervened at the last second. Prepare to feel the adrenaline of being inches away from death. And remember, sometimes, Life hangs by such a fragile thread that only luck or something more powerful decides our final moment. You don't know now and you never will. A car out of control, a stray bullet, or a simple slip can cut that thread in one fell swoop. Stay very attentive because at the end of this video, you will be left with a phobia of escalators. My name is Leonor Clay and this is The Darkest Secret. Today we present people who were just seconds away from dying. Number 8 We start with an unusual video. It is strange for various reasons. Some believe it was an earthquake and others a simple accident. Look at these people and then change your gaze to this girl. Is this an ice skating ring? <laughs> Oof. Wow, look how close that was. Although she was saved, Dang. That woman's reaction when she saw that tremendous structure collapse wow. was the worst decision she could have made. Lucky, lucky she just fell right there. Look at that. Just, wow. That's insane. If she had thrown herself to the ground just a few inches ahead, wow. she would not have been alive. To tell the story. The man above was watching her, man. Like, that is insane. Like, she's ice skating, I believe. That's ice skating, you know? Like, but regards what's going on here, like, if she didn't fall and kept kept walking, running or whatever, that's game over. Oh, my goodness. Did any of you guys, like, experience something like this that closely happened? Um... You know, just let us know in the comments, you know. that That's insane. I'm glad she's okay. This is a living example that sometimes Ooh. that life gives you only seconds to make the right decision. That's facts. Number seven. Mm. We immediately begin with what seems like a miracle. This could have been such a violent road incident that it should have left fatal victims. But that superior force made everyone escape unscratched in an almost obvious way. can't make that up that is crazy that is crazy did you see how that van lost control did like a 360 spin and went right into that garage it almost looked like a garage like for the car to go in like 
How do you even do that? Like, that's insane. Those two people right there, the driver, they all are lucky right there. That could have, like, been, you know, really tragic right there. Like, that's insane. That's scary. Have any of you guys been in some type of event like this, close to, like, getting hurt really bad or even killed by a car flying at you? Oh, wow. How lucky these people were, as if it were about a force field. Ooh. It seems that death did not have the opportunity to get its claws in this time, allowing a much wider and purer destiny. And see, you can't even do it. What could you do about that? I mean, someone could have looked the other way. You can hear the skit, but it's just, it's too fast. Pace, like, what you gonna do about that, you know? That's why, like, we gotta pray every day, every second. Of just being, you know, when we wake up, just being here because anything is possible that could happen to you and, and change your life forever, you know? So just always remember that. To transform this violent action mm. into nothing. Ooh. Number six. Wow. Mm. What happens in this video is a clear example that you should always keep an eye on your children. They cannot determine the danger they are sometimes in. In this video, the electric gate closed the door with such a force that if it had not been for her mother, she would have broken oh, her little arm in goodness. two. Surely this girl's parents will never... Ooh, that was close. I was thinking... You know, this is the first time I'm watching the videos, actually, with you guys. Um, that's just intense right there. I thought it was going to be like some type of evil soul coming around trying to kidnap the baby and stuff like that. I didn't expect no no electric fence to almost, you know, crush this little girl arm and stuff like that. That was close. Neglect her again. Did any of y'all... Number five. Did any of y'all, like been through something like that where a door or electric fence or anything that closes and it closes on you and it just barely hits you or it did get you but it could have been worse you know injuries and stuff like losing a hand losing a foot leave your comment below on something similar to this incident all right oh man glad she's okay that's a hero mom wow Whenever you ride a vehicle, and especially a motorcycle, you must be aware of your surroundings. Because mm -hmm. you may be driving well, but you have no idea how the rest are doing it. See, the thing with driving, um, period, or anything, you just got on a bike, a bicycle, you know, skate, you just have to be aware of your surroundings. And today with social media, you have people on their phones looking down, not paying attention, you have like animals as dogs is running across the street, you know, causing another car or bike or whatever to spin out and go in your way, you know, just faulty electric lights, something goes wrong with the light, you know, anything that happened with two red lights on opposite direction, you know. So even when you're going past the the red the 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 you know when the light changes from red to green, I never go straight out. When it's on green, I wait, I count like three seconds. One, two, three. And I'm looking left and right, no matter if I have the right of way. Because you never know who's speeding through there to try to catch that red light. All right? So just remember that, you know? Keep aware. When accidents are born from recklessness. What you see now had to have been a serious accident. It had all the factors. But luck gave this motorcyclist a second chance. What? What 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 are we watching here? How many lanes these guys taking up? Okay, this look like a different country, right? Look at this lane. Look at look at this lane right here. Like yeah, this is definitely not in the U.S. Like, that, I don't even know how to explain, like, the two lanes, you know? 
Um, but he's on a left lane, obviously, so this is a different country, you know. In the U.S., you drive on a, you know, on the right side, you know. So, um, yeah. So, I guess the passerbys that we've seen is supposed to be on their left driving, right? But these, but they were just going wild. That's crazy. You a can't prepare yourself for that. situation that happened so fast and sudden. Oh, the car was okay. It was the, the bike. Maneuver. There was no way he could It was three that bikes in that lane trying to he speed up. Let's show but that. The, uh, Let me show you. See? The car is in his right, you know, lane. The bikes are trying to speed past. That's what's going on. Oops. They look, they trying to speed past, but then notice well, he's trying to speed past. Those two, they so far away. Like that look crazy. That way, hold on, hold on. That's let me see. We're going kamikaze. Yeah, the bikes are just Tricycle fast. Sitting so they were just trying to get in front of that car. Accelerating and against traffic. See? In action that Yo, y'all gotta be careful on these bikes, man. This time, luck saved all three of them. Number oh, four. Man, did any of you guys? I know. I think we all went through this driving. You know, I've been through this before. Not that crazy. I had I did have when I was going on the highway and you know turn on the highway and then someone was turning off into the, towards me. I was like what the heck is going on? I started beeping. It was not too fast. It was like one of those loops. So I had time to like er, 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 and then move over. You know they you know they slowed down. I told them, "Yo, yo, this is this is a one way man this is get on you know it was one of those crazy intersections where you could choose to go on the highway go on a local on a local street and stuff like that and that person just went on the wrong i don't know probably just drunk or nothing like that but that was like years ago but everything's okay but be careful Do you remember the previous video where I told you about a demon that is capable of getting into your head and convincing you to do things that put your life in danger? That's the de this devil. This may be That's another example of that. Something mysterious oh, and corrupt had to go through this man's mind to carry out such an irrational act. Oh my goodness. Wait, 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 wait. What is wrong with you people? Do you agree with me when I say that it was a masterful save? I just had to pause for that because that guy is a grown ass man. All right. He's an adult. And you're doing stupid things like that. Jumping over a rail. I don't care if it's a platform over there. We doing that for likes and followers and stuff like that? Like, what? You playing with your life, dude. Like, you jumped over. He could have easily slid all the way down there, and that's game over. Even if he fell on that platform where he's at right now, it could have collapsed on him because of the more weight that he have. Like, on a real... I mean, you was drinking. I don't know what the heck was in your head. Like, like the darkest secret was saying, maybe possessed. I don't know, mentally. I don't even think it was all that. I just think it's foolishness right there for the camera, for showing off. Please stop doing this stuff, all right? Your life means much more than little, like, things like this, you know? Don't do stunts like this, man. It's not worth it. Did you guys ever do any of these things right here? Do something like this that's crazy? I mean, when we was young, we did crazy things. But to this level, did you see anything like this? Comment below, all right? Oh, my goodness. Oh, a doubt. However, actions like these lead us to questions. Look at this. What was going through this individual's mind to carry out such an act? Something wow. that looked dangerous from afar. From a distance, it was obvious that something bad could happen. <laughs> Look at her face. Slipping, or even left hanging, only stupidity, or a demon had to have clouded this person's mind. You're right. Those two. I Number believe it's three. one of those two. 
how many things could go wrong on racetracks, especially when the only thing separating you from the speeding motorcycles are just three tires stacked on top of each other. Because of these things of fate, the motorcycle changed its speed. Ooh, ooh, that don't look good. But anyway, uh, I would never really ride a bike, at least something like this to an extent where you're dry, you know, riding fast. If I get on a bike, it's going to be one of those dirt right bikes on the dirt roads and stuff, you know, just for fun. I'm not, no. Just before hitting the store Ooh. with full force with a father and son. Oh. Observe. Tell me if this doesn't seem like the work of an external force. Wow. Now, if it was just simple luck, from Look now on, that. they better think. See, I can't do that, man. I don't get no drills, no trip, you know, uh, no thrills. I'm getting tongue twisted now. Off of looking at race cars and race bikes and stuff like that. So even if I did go to something like this, I'm not standing, I'm not sitting there being comfortable around the track because anything could go wrong like that. Like, they have a wall there, as you can see. They have a, a wall, you know, but it's so, it's not high enough for anything. Like a bike doing what is this day. Look how short the wall is. Like, if you're going to have a wall there, I mean, you can't even put it taller. <laughs> now that I think about it, you can't put it taller because then the people won't be able to see. But it should be a higher platform, if anything, you know, like a, you know, like a, a what you call it, bleachers or something like that. You know, higher risers, so the people could sit there and watch, just in case. You know, that's dangerous right there. Have this ever happened to any of you guys before? Like something similar? Drop it down below your comment. All right, yo, this is crazy. I'm glad everybody's okay. They better think mm. they're lucky stars. Ooh. Number two. I hope the guy on the bike is okay. He should be okay, though. They didn't mention nothing. All the people you see on screen were shocked after witnessing an event that they will surely never see again in their lives. Aliens? Moments before, the seemingly quiet street was the scene of a shocking accident. From which, fortunately, there were no victims. Good. The images speak for themselves. A water leak. What you think is going to happen, guys? What? The cyclist is practically saved by a miracle. What were the chances of being unharmed if the wheel hit him? These things. Yo, look at that. He's in between getting sandwiched by a wheel out of control and a truck. Yo, you can see right here that the wheel came off over here. Um, yo, he's lucky. He's so lucky that it didn't just go out of control there. And he's just lucky the truck managed not to swerve out and hit him i know he was hearing that stuff though then see that's another thing when you're in the public using headphones and stuff mind you man don't have those noise cancellation joints outside man because you can't really hear if you got it up loud the music you can't hear all the 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 the, the, the cr craziness that's going on like, how could you react quick enough? You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying he have headphones. It look like he, he don't have headphones on. But little things like that could save your life, too. Oh, my goodness. You have the power if to this happened to you lives. or seen something, In drop it down image, below. It is observed that the wheel oh would attach from the truck moves forward completely uncontrolled without anyone or anything. That happens so fast. Of stopping it. A violent incident in which, fortunately, there were no victims to regret. 
that's good. But yo, God bless everyone. Whew. If you don't want to end up with phobia of escalators, you better end the video here. <laughs> now I'm good. But um, have any of you guys had phobia of, you know, going on an escalator? I used to when I was a kid. Yeah, I think a lot of kids probably had the same issue. You know, you never seen the escalator before, and you see the people get on. And I'm looking at the, I just remember a little basis of the stuff. I was probably like only seven, eight, or something like that. And I just remember going to Macy's. That is, you know, from New York City, Macy's, and it was that that wooden. They got like the wooden electric. I mean, a wooden electric wooden escalators. You know. So it makes those noises, clank, 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 you know, and stuff like that. So that I think that added a lot to it. And then, you know, my shoelace got stuck in there before, and I think that's when it all started where I just kept on, you know. But it didn't last long, my phobia. It was just for a quick, you know, couple of years probably when I was that age, and then I was fine after that. So have you witnessed that? Let's just go to the video. Leave your comment, and we'll see you next time. But if you're strong and brave, then keep watching. In this video, you can see a mother going up an escalator with her son. Everything was normal until suddenly, the panel covering the escalator motor came loose and the woman fell directly on top of the motor. Oh my goodness. By an almost angelic luck, her feet fell out of the gears and rotating elements. Oh and she was my able God. With that is crazy. And then it was a couple people right there, too. God bless her. Only minor injuries. Them, the baby now, and the mother. Think that all escalators are put together the same way. In the same plate Damn. that she stepped on. You will step on the next time. Wow. I didn't expect that to happen. Woo! Thank God, man, that, you know, that baby could have easily just fell in there. Like, she could have panicked and dropped the baby. Or, you know, that's crazy. Oh when you go gosh. up one of these things, mm. and if it becomes loose or is poorly maintained, and you will fall into the rotating mechanism, Damn. and maybe you won't have the same luck. Now that you know this... I hope you think of me the next time you ride an escalator. See, and now you give me phobia. this video with your friends too. You giving me Post phobia now. Networks. Dark and secret. And maybe you'll save some. You mess with me <laughs> by making them reflect that they're alive every oh time they go goodness. out. Thank God they okay. Hands by a thread. That so don't do insane. things that increase tension. Wow. My name is Leonor Clay, and this oh, was goodness. the darkest secrets. Secret. Thank you to the darkest secret. Thank you all for watching also. God bless you all. And stay tuned for more content. And always remember, be aware of all your surroundings, all right? Because you never know when our day is there to come. But you could avoid the early expiration date. Take care.